I looked into the eyes of um, many of the Frenchmen that I passed on the way out, and man, their eyes were huge. They were just red, bold, and I knew we were going to be up against it. And that they were just unrelenting. Every ruck they climbed into, they booted us, they kicked us, and we just carried on playing and giving back as much as we could. I think within about 15, 20 minutes in the first half, I got caught at the bottom of a ruck and got booted right in the face and I lost three teeth on my uh, my right hand side. So I just carried on, got on with the game. And uh, just before half time, I went into another a defensive ruck and I grabbed the ball with two hands and I ripped it free. And then I looked up at the same time. And as I looked up, John Pierre Garraway was horizontal and he hit me straight in the middle of the forehead. Man, he knocked me out cold. It took me two minutes to come round. And uh, Jock Hobbs said, you can't go off, you've got to stay. We've got no one on the bench. They're all injured. And so we, we carried on playing. And then about 10 minutes into the second half, I went down over Daniel De Broca and uh, ripped the ball off him. And as I stood up, Daniel kicked me right in the nuts. Man, did it bloody hurt. So I was cringing there for a little while and, and uh, went, sat down on the ground to try and get my breath back and chucked a bit of water down there. And I thought nothing of it and I carried on playing. And, and the All Black changing room is very, very morbid, very, very quiet after a loss. And this is the first loss that I'd experienced in the All Black jersey. I decided to get dressed, I stood up, ripped my gear off, pulled my strides down. And then one of the guys from across the room, uh, I think it was Gary Witten or John Gallagher, and they saw something I didn't see originally, and they said, holy shit, look at that. One of my testicles has been ripped right out of the scrotum and it was hanging between my, my legs and gee, there was blood and there was uh, bits of uh, fat tissue down all over the place and uh, went out a quick shower and then basically went upstairs into a medical room and got it all tidied up and put back together. And uh, you know, just these sort of things do happen and you've just got to play on.